Hello everyone, welcome back to Ether 1. So, I've spent the past 30 minutes going... Oh my god, those are some horrendous fruit textures. Actually, they might even be vegetables, I don't know. Anyway, getting distracted. Um, <laughs> I spent the last 30 minutes... Uh, 30 minutes going back and trying to f figure out some of the old projectors. I, I have no idea. Just, I... I really don't know. 30 minutes and I made literally no progress whatsoever. It's a bit maddening, to be honest. I still have no freaking clue about the damn Mayday angles. I'm guessing that's going to be the last one I ever do. The Brimcliff mine is by far the worst. There's one projector I, have, I haven't even discovered. Which is weird. And a lot of these I've done, like like this, I've done every part but the last one. Uh, I'm pretty sure to complete this one I need three more Bibles. This one I don't even know. This has something to do with the reels that I picked up. Be damned if I know what to do with them, though. Maybe I don't even do anything with them, I'm not sure. And then at Industrial, there's the... Victory Shaft, which also, once again, every single part but the last one. With this one, I'm so close to the end result, I can taste it, but I just can't figure Such it out. Such a lonely feeling. Missing someone, I'm wondering if they've been thinking of you. So to avoid going insane, I'm just going to go to the village, do this a bit, and just hope that either something will come to me about the previous puzzles, or maybe, perhaps, there's something I need from here to complete them, although I seriously doubt that. But maybe. Ah, wreaths. I like wreaths. Although they kind of look a bit more like... Um, I don't even remember what those things are called. The things you throw that float in the water to save people. Life Preserver, that's what they're called. They kind of look like life preservers that have been painted with flowers. To the glory of God, in honored memory of the men of Pinwheel who gave their lives in the Great War. Also in grateful appreciation of the services of those who returned. Wait, sacrifice a few what? People? I'd like to know what she thinks she's sacrificing. Ooh, that's another... Um, what's it called? Dream, yeah, dream journal, I think. Yep. Oh, there we go. Haha. So, here are the personal items that you asked for. Excellent. Thank you. Have you dated them with the description labels I gave you? Of course. I went through it all. It, it, it should be pretty accurate. Good. This will be a great help. Uh, how, how is he actually doing? I, I just want to... Treatment is ongoing, Mr. Fletcher. You know that. But I'd, I'd really like to see him. Come back tomorrow, and I'll ensure that you get to spend some time together. But for now, visiting hours are over.
Alright, that leaves... One more thing to restore? Or is it two? Look at that lonely, solitary light out there. Light in a sea of darkness. Oh yeah, I'm probably going to find a way over to the lighthouse, too. It's one of the mysteries, right? The mysterious lighthouse. Hmm. Well, that's weird. The knocker code of signals, what is that doing here? Also, I should put this back before I forget about it. Memory journal number six. Jim would not stop talking today. Or, sorry, talking. That's kind of the opposite. Uh, would not stop asking today. Why don't you remember? How could you forget? I think he was frustrated with me. I felt exhausted. What does he want from me? Phyllis is one of them. She's part of an organization that says they can fix me. She says she can mend my thoughts. I think I trust her, but should I? I wonder who could possess such a gift. Alright, let's go put this thing back. I went the exact wrong way. Whoops. Yeah, there's only one more. seen that multiple times. I'll just leave that there. More tomatoes. I really want to bake something. I've got so many different cans. Tomatoes and... Actually, maybe I just... <laughs> maybe I just have tomatoes. Oh, no. No, those are beans. Okay. Yeah, I've got some variety. Beans and tomatoes and a girl got stuck tomatoes. Out to sea here once. They had to send the boats out. I'm not going to close that door behind me, even though I probably have enough room. I've had enough of the doors and bathrooms. Actually, there might be something behind the door. Okay. It's a very vertical house.
my pinwheel by the sea. And there's no other land for me. No, I shall never leave. Oh, there's no other land for me, my pinwheel by the sea. And there's no other land for me, no, I shall never leave. Looks like it's a song? Or a poem? Something. Long days at sea. The long days out at sea are taking their toll. We need more fish to keep the export open, but there are only so many hours in the day. In the slower parts of the day, I've been writing songs with my guitar and harmonica. I'm going to take it down to the crow's nest tonight and sing it for the lads. Our Frost. Ah, oh, it is a song. Okay. And there's his guitar, and I don't see a harmonica, but I think I have one. Oh, there it is. I still want to play it, but I can't seem to. I mean, I could go to the crow's nest with, like, the harmonica or something, but I don't see anywhere I could use it there. And I doubt the solution would be an entire be in an entirely different zone. Don't play down by the docks, Jean. You know you're not allowed down by the docks. Yes, ma'am. I wonder what's connected to this projector. It's obviously not what's inside the house. It's what's in this house. It's kind of far away from the projector, though. Ooh, that's new. Haven't seen that one before. I will take you. That... that that's not... No. <laughs> I don't think that bottle was, like, centered right or something. Oh. Got a little bell rigged up. Leaving the country and starting a new life together? Not the kind of decision that can be made overnight. also took place from time to time, but for some reason this never became a large port. I wonder what could have happened here. Bills. Bills, bills, bills. How can it cost... How can it cost... Wait. How can it cost too much? Oh yeah, okay, that's correct. Sorry, my brain was breaking. How can it cost too much to run a small export company in Pinwheel? Everyone seems to be getting hit hard at the moment. Hopefully this new deal with the USA will bring in good business for our small town. What is that? Is that an apple? Oh, whatever it is, it's hideous. Some hideous alien fruit. Ugh. Hmm, hmm, hmm. Didn't work the first time, nor did it work the 20th time. I'm just remembering, there was a TV back in the uh, the harbor, inside of someone's house. Uh, the same house that has the Mayday stuff. Wait, is it the Mayday stuff? I'm not sure, but anyway, it's a house inside of the harbor that has a TV, and I remember I tried to use it, and it just makes a clicking noise. And I wonder if I'm going to find, like, a remote or something. 
Wait a minute, these TVs are so old they don't even have remotes, do they? Hmm. I'm just wondering if there's any way to use the other one. Phone's off the hook. I guess they didn't want to receive any calls. Maybe they're getting calls about debt collection. Pinwheel Cinema will be closing. Mm-hmm. That is a normal light bulb, unlike the black lights that I have. Alright, this is to be filled out, obviously. So the origin, I'd assume, would be USA. What's the... or, sorry, destination would be USA. Wait, via pinwheel. So it's coming in from somewhere else, and then it's going to... Maybe that wouldn't be USA, then. I'm not sure. Okay, so I'm going to be putting something inside of the vice grips. Field Cider. Mm-mm-mm. Also, got to remind myself, keep on the lookout for Bibles. Pinwheel Post, May 7th, 1948. Pinwheel gets back to its roots. Pinwheel fishing sellers get old-fashioned with traditional troil. There should be a comma there. With traditional troil, a dance and feast to celebrate the end of the pilchard season. The family-run event was arranged for all those connected with Frost and Sons Fishing Cellar and comprised of multiple fishing partners, shopkeepers, and tradesmen who... All were to meet in the fishing cellar's loft at 6 p.m. on Friday to celebrate yet another successful season of fishing. 6 p.m. Something tells me that's going to be important, but I'm not going to write it down so that I can forget it and be screwed forevermore. Because I'm cool like that. Alright, there's got to be some goodies upstairs. Because there's not a lot down here. <laughs> Do I need to, like, collect these or something? There's an awful lot of them. Hmm. Oh. There's an upper upper stairs. Paragraph. Aw, oh, it's locked. It's missing a code wheel. I might have another one. Do I have... Yes, I do. Don't remember where I picked it up from. What are these strange fractured shapes? Eh, they're probably clouds. Yeah. Yeah, they're clouds. Some abstract piece of art. <laughs> these knocker codes again. Once again, they keep popping up. Secrets? Oh, four, five, one. I'm gonna write that down just to have it.
seriously. A thing that I already have like 20 of. I feel insulted. Why would it why would that be there? It's a bizarrely non-valuable thing to keep inside of a place where you'd normally keep valuables. Well, between that and this knocker code here, that seems to be suggesting something, I just don't know what. A brighter future. I sometimes see those two children playing outside of my window. A boy and a girl. I'm not sure their names, but I work right next to them. They're always so full of laughter. It definitely puts things into perspective. It makes you realize that there's so much more to life than just this office space. Hmm, I wonder if that would be Gene Thornton and... the other guy? John? I don't remember his name. Ooh. Can I put my official seal on stuff? I'm not sure, but let me shove this stuff in some shelf space. I'll keep that just in case it's a special knocker, maybe? <laughs> Seems unlikely. Alright, so how do I go about opening this? I don't see a keyhole. It doesn't seem to be... I, I don't see any lock. I even tried to use the knocker on it, thinking maybe I could break... Oh, wait a minute. Oh, wait a minute. Oh, I've done this before. I should probably use a black light. What if I use a normal light? Not surprisingly, that did nothing. Where's my black light? Plymouth. Pinwheel. New Jersey. Okay. So it's coming from Plymouth. Through pinwheel, which is already written down, written down, to New Jersey. That is how you pronounce it, by the way. Absolutely, exactly how you're supposed to pronounce it. Nah, eh, I'll leave that there. I've got another one. I don't know. Maybe that uh, borrow graph will open up magically when I input the correct information into the chalkboard down here. <laughs> Let's use a keyboard for this, because I'd like to get this done in quicker than 20 minutes. All aboard! <laughs> that was kind of adorable. Okay. No, where's... Let me pull the keyboard out so I can actually... There we go. Two mines already made up. This is happening. Two mines already made up. This is happening. So does that mean she and the guy got uh, maybe on board this this very ship to go to New Jersey? Mayhaps. Let's see if this thing opened up. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. How's it looking, by the way? Am I repairing that? I can't tell. No, oh, it's still logged. What the? What did that actually do? I heard something move. Hold on, I want to see what this is called. Completed shipment board. This is where most of Pinwheel's trading was done. Arsenic, tin, apples, and cider were all common exports. 
Boat repairs also took place from time to time, but for some reason this never became a large port. I wonder what could have happened here. Judging from what I've seen, I'd say the problem was bills, bills, bills. Okay, so what did that do? Oh, I haven't been back here before. Okay then. So that did repair this one, right? Partially? Yes. Need a hell of a lot more though, I don't... Is it really spread out? Like, do I need to do this stuff really far away? Because I don't see anything else I can do inside of this building other than... Get to the barograph. Or barograph, however you say it, and I don't know how to open it. It doesn't even look locked. It sounds locked. Maybe there's a key hidden somewhere. Gotta be on the lookout for some sneaky sneakies. Oh yeah, and okay, there's also this thing, but... Be damned if I know what to do with it. I forget this place. I'm gonna go somewhere else. Yet another uncompleted puzzle. I'm gonna stay on the dock for a while. Gonna stay on the edge before I go to the center of town. Can I be honest for a moment? I'm beginning to suspect that I may have been too cavalier in my approach. In fact, I'm certain I have. But these are new frontiers. Don't you understand? There's no second chance with this. I have one chance, and you're it. I don't trust often, but I have faith that you're going to complete this task, and you're going to do it with grace. Um, well, I've got a feeling I'm going to be doing it with while screaming and cursing at trying to solve these damned puzzles, especially the May Day ankle bracelet. <laughs> Bells, whatever they're called. But I will do it. Eventually. When he grows up. Money is pretty bad at the moment. I saw that Pete Field was having issues with the cider business that he runs at the top of town. And... <laughs> I really hope they fix a lot of these spelling mistakes, because... I've seen a lot of them. And I'm struggle to make any sort of living at the moment. <laughs> <laughs> that just sounds really funny. I'm struggle to make any sort of living at the moment. Don't they know I'm a single dad looking after my boy? Pete was spouting about America in the pub the other day. I wonder if the opportunities over there are real or it's or or it is a case of the grass is always greener on the other side. Christopher Fletcher.
Yeah, see here, this TV. Just like the other one. That doesn't mention. It's like I can use it, but how? I've already got one of these. Oh god. Please tell me I can get out of here. Fuck! <laughs> what have I done to myself? No! You... Uh, come on. I can't even uncrouch. Wait, wait, wait. I think it just happened for a second. I saw, I saw an uncrouch happening. It's happening. Where's my last save? It's an auto. Is that from before I did anything? Is that from when I just came to town? Is that the last time it auto saved? Are you kidding me? <laughs> Thank God I can teleport. I think I've got to teleport somewhere else. It's gonna say you are here, which means it won't teleport. Yeah, I've got to teleport somewhere else. Okay, let's go here. To the industrial center. And, eh, I don't like the industrial center. Let's go back. To the village. Okay. Uh, where was I? Okay, I started going down here. Let's try this again. I'm done with that room, very much so. Lighthouse, music box, mm-hmm. Yeah, pretty sure that's supposed to be a ball, but it really does kind of look like a melon. Hmm, looks delicious. I feel like I'm supposed to paint something. But I can't. I wonder if somebody was going to paint that fruit. Fruit and vegetables. It's kind of a classic, isn't it? A bowl of fruit and vegetables? Although in that case, it's a plate. Well, I don't know, maybe it's technically a bowl. If only I could ride it. Age six. The lighthouse is shiny and it makes me think about the sea. I wish when I am sad that I could run away and hide somewhere safe. Everyone says that the lighthouse keeps us safe from harm. I miss Mummy. Tom. Hmm. 
<laughs> it's missing an arm. And an eye. From Gene. Dear Thomas. Oh, that was his name. Thomas. I'm so sorry to hear about your dad. I know everyone was worried about him. My mom and dad were. I just... I guess I wish there was something I could do to make everything okay. Dad says he doesn't know what will happen to you, and that frightens me lots. I know this is soon, and I don't even know if you will get this letter, but I hope you are okay. Love, Jean. more of the memory helping prescription stuff that I saw back at the Ether Institute. Jazz. All I can hear coming from his room is that damn jazz record that he picked up from over in Devlin Town. Sometimes I wish I hadn't given him his mother's gramophone after she left, but the lad looked like he would cry if I'd said no. More stubborn than his mother ever was. C. Fletcher. Makes me wonder if there's like a single pixel that I can pick something up through that gap. Hmm? Hmm? No. That'd be stupid. I think that's it for this house. Let's keep skirting around the edge, see what I can find. Oh, I know where that goes. Back to the harbor. Did I ever tell you that my sister suffered from dementia? She was only 28 years old when she was diagnosed. I'm sure I don't need to tell you how incredibly rare that is. Something in me, a longing to find a cure, and with that I began to focus my research on dementia, eventually leading me here. Had my experiments been around at the time, I, I'm sure we could have prevented the inevitable. I'm sure we could have saved her. She died when she was 39. You would have liked her. Dying at the age of 39 from dementia. Wow. A 
Reminder, make sure to take the check the date on the milk. Hmm. What could I use that for? I'm trying to think if there's anything I needed to take the bolts off of. Oh, this is the thing that needs the record, right? Or maybe not. I guess that is the record. But they've got three pianos? Oh my god. Very musical household, I suppose. actually know what that is. What is this? Is this some sort of a purse thing? Oh, right. Description. Wallet. That is a very strange wallet. I've never seen one like it. Oh, it's a piano tuning key. That must be why there's so many pianos. I think I'm going to need it. It's a lot of drugs. It's a memory one. Can't even read that. It's too blurry. Same with that one. I think it says, like, hydro-something at the end. 20-something milligrams? I think it says 25 milligrams. So, can I actually tune these pianos? You know, I probably need to use it at, like, the church or something. Let me just check, though. No, I can't use it. Pinwheel Cinema. The one that was was closing down or is about to. Ah, damn, I need a key. Let's go around back this way. See, there's another way in. Hmm. The lost car keys finally turn up on the table by the front door. 
miles. This was a busy surgery. It says here, support doctors would have to be telegraphed weeks in advance, just so she could take a week's holiday. <laughs> oh my god. Ah. <sighs> Sounds like a nightmare. Was that noise in response to this? What the heck? Hmm. Very strange. Alright, okay, I gotta enter something in here. The date. It's, it's the first, isn't it? I think it's the first. Hmm. I'm not sure who I'm entering now. Is it Gene Thornton? I mean, I could try. Oh, oh whoops. Should be zero, zero. I didn't misspell her name, did I? Thornton, no? Okay, so I guess it's not her, or the date's wrong or something. Hmm. Well, if it is May 1st, and that's what all the calendars seem to say, when I find them inside of houses, then it's going to be right in the middle of that. Of uh, Dr. Foster being away. Obviously, I'm supposed to find that information from somewhere else, since there's no information in there whatsoever. I'm just thinking of the key I have, called the Orchard Key. I don't think it's called the Orchard Cinema, but... It's where the shot, is it not? Nope. Make sure I don't have anything here that's gonna help me get in. I haven't taken stock of all of my items for a while. Beer, beer, wallet, tapper, tuning key, magnifying glass. Most of the stuff I probably don't need. Matches, codes. Okay. This is weird bloody handprints again. Annual Morris Dance Competition. Just tell me the damn names of the freaking ankle bells, for God's sake. <sighs> Health and safety. Mrs. Wainwright. I simply cannot believe that Pinwheel Primary is stopping the children from using the jungle gym due to health and safety reasons. What is this world coming to? It's been there for years. Even we used it when we were young. <laughs> Next, people will be saying that smoking kills, for God's sake. <laughs> Spoiler, it does. Is there something under that hat? No. And now I have a massive hat. Damn it. I shouldn't have picked it up. It was a mistake. Ooh, it's locked. Wait, the thing that thing actually opened? I really didn't expect that.
Hmm. It's obviously a lot I'm supposed to do in here. Lots of interactive things. Can't open the fridge, can't open this. This thing opens for some strange reason. What am I looking at? Oh, those are toy cars, aren't they? Yeah, they're toy cars. Seems to be broken. Wow. Look at that sunset. Oh man, this if the sun was sitting here, it would look beautiful, wouldn't it? Looking under this bridge, glancing off the water. Another one for my collection. His hands were shaking with fear. There was no use trying to hide it. The lamp handle was rattling and the light was dancing all over the place, making it look far more scary than it actually was. You okay? Asked Andy, trying not to laugh. What are we doing? Barked Rob. Looking for the knocker, remember? He must not be here, Andrew offered disappointedly. How do you know? whispered Rob. Because he can smell fear. If he was in here, you'd be a goner already. At that moment, three loud bangs echoed through the whole mine shaft. Oh, crap! cried Rob. What the hell was that? Andrew said nothing. Again, three loud bangs, followed by three more. They're getting closer! Rob yelled. More banging and more banging. Rob felt paralyzed, and Andrew just stood behind him, saying nothing. The banging got closer and closer, until a figure could be seen. Something. What was it? Moving closer and closer, banging all the time. Oh, God! What are we going to do? cried Rob. And just then, the figure came into the light. It was their little brother. Harry! yelled Rob. Andrew fell to the floor laughing. That was priceless, Rob. I think I'll take this one, too. My friend. I'm so lucky that Thomas is my friend. Without him there, the boys steal my lunchbox and take my pocket money. He sticks up for me. They threw my shoes into the tree today, by the school, and now I can't get them back. I hope he's not sick again tomorrow. Hmm, there's two parts of the May Day celebration. No ankle bells, though. Everyday troubles. I don't know how to pronounce that. Jacqui? I don't know. I hope Sean managed to get the day off work for the May Day celebrations. It would be great to see you both there. Sadly, my husband has to work again. I'm not sure he even tries to get the, the day off like Sean does. I'll be bringing the boys. I tell you, they're a nightmare sometimes. Just wait until you have some yourself. Harry threw some of his best toys in the sink this morning and nearly flooded the place. 
You would have thought Andrew would be setting a good example, but now he's just as bad. At least Rob listens to me. Anyway, must go. I think I heard a pot smash. <laughs> so that's why the toys were in the sink. Because he's a little dick. Okay, so there's all this stuff to interact with inside of here, but how do I do it? Back, yeah. I haven't been in here, have I? I think I just opened the door. Yeah, I've not been in here. Apple tree. Do you remember when we first bought this house and there's a single apple tree growing in the front garden? Can you believe how far that one tree has taken us? Happy anniversary. Oh, I want to open their present. Whoa, what the hell? This table has no collision. Weird. It's a spectral table and a spectral present. Note to Beth. I went across to the doctor's today like you asked, but he's out of town and his surgery is locked with no one home. I'll have to check back later on to see if he's returned, but it's not looking hopeful... It's not looking hopefully? <laughs> okay, it's not looking hopefully. If he's not, I promise I'll go back around on Monday. Pete. Okay, maybe that's the person I need to enter in. So his name's Pete, but what's his last name? I'm going to write him down as Pete question mark. And then doctor question mark. Go back on Monday. Okay, I don't know what day it actually is. I'm pretty sure it's the 1st of May, but I don't know if that's a Monday, a Friday, a Saturday, or what. It's a big place. Really big. Secret recipe. I think I've cracked it. A new cider recipe to revive our business. Sorry about the mess. I'll clean it before dinner. Oh, that's why there's buckets full of apples. Science. Food science. Um, listen. Whatever you may think of me, you're doing a fantastic job here, Thomas. Without you, none of this would have been possible. We wouldn't be this close. I hope that you can find it in your heart to trust me. And, and to believe when I say that I want to get you out of there as much as I want to save this mind. Did you just call me Thomas? I just realized before this, I didn't actually know my name. Wait, my name's Thomas? Isn't that the name of... Gene Thornton... Um, hmm. See, I'm having a bit of a problem here, because... I've been playing this for so long, and there's such a long distance, and so many things 
um, in between uh, reveals in the story that it's kind of hard to piece it all together because I learn a little tidbit like that like my name is Thomas and then I spend hours trying to solve projectors so it kind of all blurs together but isn't Thomas the name of the like Jean's husband or boyfriend or brother I'm not sure but I'm pretty sure that's the first time she said my name Fishing. Hitting the fresh sea air today did me a lot of good. George took us out into the bay for a spot of casual fishing. A good chance to unwind and get things off our chest. George mentioned that his daughter's friend Thomas had been having a rough time since his mother left, and that he and Ellen had been quite worried about his welfare recently. I hope the lad is alright. It's not right for someone so young to have to deal with his father's demons. Okay, I did write this down at least. I know George um, and Ellen are the parents of Gene Thornton. I wrote that down, at least. So George mentioned that his daughter's friend, alright, so Jean's father mentioned that his... mentioned that Jean's friend Thomas, which is what Phyllis just called me, called me Thomas, so... I'm gifted? Uh, why am I a restorer? Why am I restoring my own friend's memories, or... I... hmm... It's only gifted people that can be restorers, right? You know what I want to try to do right now? Close this door. Do you know what I'm not going to do right now? Close this door. Basement time. I've already got one of those. Right. I think I do. Yeah. Hmm. Nothing down here but a crap ton of cider. <laughs> 